getting reports that a 147,000 ton tanker has run aground in South Wales and it's said to be spilling oil. The main story this lunchtime, pollution alert off the West Wales coast as an oil tanker spills out thousands of gallons of crude oil. I think I was putting down here what was coming from here, straight on the paper, how I felt, um, you know, and um, it's all here. Um, a lot of it hurts to read it now. A lot of it hurts to read it now. Uh, a sudden squall snapped three of the tug tow rope, sending the Sea Empress out of control. She ran aground and more oil began pouring from her damaged cargo holds. Helicopters were scrambled as the crew were airlifted to safety. Day three. Um, Saturday the 17th, sat at home watching uh, bulletins on TV. Uh, a sense of knowing that I was watching my livelihood. A sickly smell of oil hangs over Milford Haven. This isn't Sheen, and its ability to cause damage to the coastline, not to mention the wildlife, is only too evident. You know, my colleagues are going to turn around and they're saying to me, they're phoning me up in desperation on the phone. They've been phoning me and saying, you know, what am I going to do? Where do I go? Salvage experts have started... The BBC started TV breakfast show, um, stress of despair and worry of myself and members of the association. Watch the tanker on the mid-channel rocks, knowing the salvers were losing it. Meanwhile, wildlife agencies are accusing the authorities of playing down the scale of the disaster. Oh, that's surprising how many cockles are going back here, Tim. Yeah, and it's surprising the little ones, look. Look at the little ones. Went down to Gowerswick Bay with Mark nice to look at the effects of the oil spill. Found that the cockles had all come to the surface, and this wasn't normal. Oh, look at the oil there. Yeah, just come out of that one there. Hey, look at the birds that are going to be feeding on these now. Yeah, they'll be feeding on these. Oh my God, even in the little one. Look, look. Oh. Even in the little one. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. Look at that, look at that. And that's just out of that little shell. Uh -huh. You can imagine what it's going to be like overall. I mean, you know, that's just in a small area, isn't it? And another one here. That's a nice cockle. Look at that. That's a really nice cockle, that. And I don't know what it's going to be like in Pen Cloud, you know, because it's gone across Camarthen Bay. So for the birds and well, that's your food chain, isn't it? That's the food chain. Fish and everything. Fish the lot. God Almighty. Millions of these things around here. Not terrible. <laughs> Somebody's just come in here and whacked a tanker on, on, on rocks and spilled tremendous amounts of oil. About 50,000 tonnes of oil are thought to have leaked from the tanker Sea Empress. Conservationists want the area declared a disaster zone as oil spreads towards the islands of Skoma and Stockholm, which are populated by birds and seals. Now we go through that, we go through the path really. Are we doing it, man? Thanks for that. Sure. Good night, isn't it? Yeah, good. You're winning, no? Yeah. Yeah, so. What a battle, isn't it? Favourite machine to come down now and suck it all up. Yeah, oh yeah, 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 you get that up there. You get the gully sucker down. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The mess up around the coast step there. Is, Is there? there? Yeah. You've been over the far side. You haven't seen yeah. any birds, anything like that? Yeah, yeah they're on the side, you side know. Is there? We're just going to go over there now, see if we get. Uh, we don't go over there. a minute, left. Yeah. Yeah, we'll have a nip over there now and have a look. Yeah, we'll have a lovely job. Yeah. <laughs> ah, dear, oh dear. Never mind, boys. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, then catch you later. Yeah. Yeah, just trying to get back there. Take the time, Mark. You look to go, he's going to go. Take the time. 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 Take the time.
try and take over, make it difficult. Better if we try and drive him up, yeah? 